everyone and welcome back to another great episode of Jazzy Jeff's trading card review series. So I know a lot of you are wondering what's going on. You said the last episode was the season finale and it still stands as the season finale. This is just a bonus encore episode for season five. So there's a lot to cover so let's dive right into it. Thanks to Ryan Kinnar for sending me trading cards, and boy do I have a lot to say about these. So, up first, this would count as episode 87. That being said, uh, this is the official uh, ending of season 5, and I will not be doing any more trading card episodes after this episode. So Ryan and anybody else, if you send me cards, I will not be doing videos for a while. So you're going to have to stay patient, unfortunately. Okay? Number two, speaking of people sending me cards, as well as people commenting on my videos, I just want to make an overall blanket statement, and this isn't aimed at Austin Wilcott or anybody like that, but I do not want anybody attacking other people for sending me cards. There was a comment made in a recent video, and I'm not going to call anybody out, but they said a, a hurtful comment that was untrue, and they, and they stated that I hated um, trading cards that were sent to me, and that is just not true. So going forward, if I see any more comments in regards to putting words in my mouth saying that I hated something or I disliked something when I actually in reality did not, that comment will be deleted. I will not tolerate that on my YouTube. If you have a personal problem with me or you have an issue, you need to contact me and message me properly either on Twitter or Instagram or Facebook or you can email me. I will include my amazing Atari aficionado email that I, that I give out to friends and fans. But otherwise, I don't want any trouble being started because I appreciate everything that is sent to me. And just because I don't open up a, a particular card, or just because I don't have a whole lot to say about a particular pack of trading cards, doesn't mean that I hate the cards, and doesn't mean that I dislike the card. At the end of the day, if I do, if I do an episode on cards, it probably means that I like them, and I care about those cards enough to do an episode. So, not that anybody complained, and not that anybody said anything, but I just feel like heading into 2020, my YouTube is going to be a no-hate zone. You can still make dirty jokes, Austin Wilcutt. That's not what this is about. But this is strictly about people attacking other people or attacking other trading cards. And it will not be tolerated, and if it continues, you will be blocked from my YouTube. Let's move on. Now, on to the next topic. I appreciate everybody that sends me cards. I just want viewers to know that if you send me cards, I may not review them. Especially if I'm unfamiliar with the trading cards. So don't get upset if a 
if a pack of trading cards that you sent me doesn't get reviewed or if you know a random toy or something that you send me doesn't get reviewed because unfortunately as much as I love nerdy things and you clearly can tell that I do I don't always have time and I also don't always have something to say about everything and there's also some things that I just don't know enough about now next up on the chopping block <laughs> Getting back to Rhino Canar 14 at YouTube. I sincerely appreciate you and everything that you send me. You sent me 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 packs of the Rocketeer trading cards. <laughs> and then whatever this is. So I don't know what happened here, Ryan. I hope this didn't get wrecked in the mail. But if you did send this to me on purpose, I'm going to be reviewing these. Because this is the funniest thing I've ever seen in my life. Look at these cards. They look like some, the mailman sat on them. So, that being said, I am going to open up these. Unfortunately, here comes the bad news and I'm ready for the hate, baby. I am not opening up these cards because these are worth more to me to trade them to somebody that is going to give them a good home and somebody that wants them. There are Rocketeer fans out there and there are also people out there that can make money off of these cards. Maybe I even might be able to make money off of these cards. So do not get upset if you send me something and I don't end up reviewing it. So. That being said, uh, one other quick announcement for all my viewers out there. I've already discussed Rocketeer cards. So if you're a true Jazzy Jeff fan, you would know only one season ago, episode, I want to say 52, I did Rocketeer cards. And I didn't really care for them. <laughs> Because they're movie cards. And as you all know, you can say it with me, I don't really care for movie cards. And you know what? I think it's better to be truthful than to lie. And if this video gets hate, or if people get angry at me for doing this video, then bring it on, baby. Because I'm ready for 2020, and I'm ready for the comments. Okay, so I've... <laughs> Hey everyone, Jazzy Jeff here. If you're watching this message, that means I fucked up something during the editing process and lost that footage of me opening those cards. But honestly, it's probably for the best that that footage was lost because this video wasn't about making fun of anything or making fun of anybody and something tells me that footage may have come off the wrong way. Also, this is not a scapegoat for not showing that footage. I legitimately, like a jackass, deleted it thinking I did not need it. I love deleting things before I know if I need it or not. I absolutely drive myself crazy. Welcome to the world of my life and editing. <clears throat> this episode wasn't necessarily about showing trading cards. This episode was just about the fans and my friends and people that send me stuff and I just felt like I needed to clear the air on a few issues that I've run into this year and I really don't want to be running into those issues next year. So once again, even though this was filmed in 2019, this will be released at some point later in 2020. So thank you so much for watching season five. I will be taking a break from trading card reviews and focusing on other videos. So stay tuned and thanks for watching my channel. The preceding announcement has been paid for by the New World Order.